First responders in Tallahassee, Florida, coming together and going beyond the call of duty to help children and families in need. CNN's Ryan Young has the story. Here in Tallahassee, home of the Florida State Seminoles, it's not uncommon to spend autumn Saturdays in a parking lot. Florida State! Woo! What makes this particular Saturday gathering a little strange is that there is no tailgate. These folks are not here for a football game. Great causes, it seems, can make for strange, and in this case, noble bedfellows. So let's build some bunk beds. Appreciate you. More than 100 officers, sheriff's deputies, firefighters, and EMS workers volunteering on their day off to build bunk beds for Tallahassee's families in need. There are families within our community that don't have everything that we have and that we take for granted. You guys are going to help us measure the wood, cut the wood, sand it, stain it, assemble it. The group behind today's bill, Sleep in Heavenly Peace, was founded 10 years ago in an Idaho garage. Today they have chapters in dozens of states and have built and assembled and delivered more than 140,000 bunk beds. The labor is all voluntary. The lion's share of them, first responders. We definitely appreciate how you, as first responders, affect us and help us in the community. You protect us, you keep us safe, you take care of us. Um, and today, you guys are going above and beyond you know, the job throws a lot of uh, unfortunate events at us through our careers, and, you know, we see a lot of emergency scenes. So these kind of opportunities in our community, which we do uh, a lot more than this, but it's, um, it's rewarding. Part of being a first responder is not just doing the job, but giving back to the community on our off time as well. It's something we do all the time. On this particular Saturday, two sets of bunks will be built for the Smith family. The four children ranging from 6 to 13 have been sleeping on mattresses on the floor. For Sleep in Heavenly Peace's Tallahassee chapter, one of these bunks marks the 1,000th that was built, delivered, and assembled by local first responders. You think it's just a bed, but it's just a bed that you guys created. You're touching somebody's lives, and today is going to be a really special event. As rewarding as the volunteer work is itself, it also serves to bridge divides in their community. Although we do the job every day, this allows us to build those positive relationships because most of the time when we respond, we're responding to calls for service. Things aren't going well or they wouldn't be calling us. This gives us an opportunity to interact with our community, to help our community and to show our community that we're just like everybody else. Ryan Young, CNN, Tallahassee, Florida. So great. And thank you to Ryan for that report. New Day continues right now.